Queen's adamant about attack Sussexes as planned after they declare not require Palace's forgiveness. Queen Elizabeth had a strategy set in place to deal with Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's royal exit. Although the couple caused an eruption within the hegemony of the royal family with their abrupt departure, the monarch tackled it very smartly. According to royal expert Stuart Pearce, the eruption took because of Harry and Meghan leaving the way that they did, although of course, their departure was well known about by Prince Charles, by the Queen and also by Prince William, etc. way before we knew about it. The expert continued, you can just imagine when Harry, full of love for the lady he was falling in love with, arrived back and went to see Her Majesty. She'd have said let's take this easily, let's court her for a year, and then let's talk again. They talked again from what I understand from the people that I know, and Harry was emphatic I want to marry her and the strategy was created. Pierce revealed further, Her Majesty would say what happens if this doesn't work with the British people? So the whole strategy was developed right at the very beginning, it came to a shock to us but actually, the mechanism was always there, all of the possibilities. That's how pragmatic Her Majesty is, which is why she's able to fly like an eagle over the whole thing observing, and not get caught up in the corruption or the vilification or the negativity. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle don't need the Queen to forgive them as they are likely to still be on good terms following their bombshell claims about why they left the firm, a royal biographer has claimed. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex shocked the world earlier this year when they revealed being part of the royal institution made them feel trapped, with Meghan even saying she felt suicidal. However, the couple have always maintained they think the Queen is wonderful throughout their recent drama and even named their daughter Lilibet which was a childhood nickname of the Queen. Royal biographer Stuart Pearce said he believes the Queen is a forgiving person and so will not have felt any anger or animosity towards Harry and Meghan for speaking out while carving out their new life in the US. He also compared Harry and Meghan with Prince Andrew's ex-wife Sarah Ferguson, as she has also spoken publicly about the royal family in the past but still has a close relationship with the Queen. He said that Sarah recently talked about her absolute admiration of the sage-like qualities of the Queen, which I found surprising. Sarah still lives with Andrew in the Royal Lodge, which was the home of the Queen Mother, and a great scene of joy during the time the late King George VI was still alive, as it is where Elizabeth and Margaret had their little cottage. Meghan added during the interview that the Queen had always been wonderful to her. She said, on one of our first joint engagements together, we had breakfast together that morning and she gave me a gift, some beautiful pearl earrings and a matching necklace, I just really loved being in her company. We were in the car going in between engagements and she has a blanket that sits across her knees and it was chilly and she pulled it across my knees. It made me think of my grandmother. She, the Queen, has always been warm and inviting and really welcoming. There's the family, and then there are the people that are running the institution, those are two separate things and it's important to be able to compartmentalize that because the Queen, for example, has always been wonderful to me.